nah. nah. They should have been stopped. You wanted a little more action. No, I mean, I mean, uh, the, the the first round he almost stopped him, but the, right. I thought that last stop, which might have been, was a little. No, bit, he was he was eating some hands. My mm, is a little bit numb right now. Did you feel like he was hurt though at that at that of last course. round? Every time I hit him with the right hand, and I and I had enough distance in between to hit him with a clean shot, I hurt him. Cause he, I, if 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 I if I if my hands feel regular, I ain't really do the job. So if I if you once you hit a guy, you feel the impact in your hand. You know for a fact you landed a good shot. It's not messed up per forever. It's just I need some time, like you know, a week. That's it. He he um he actually came back though in the fourth round and landed a couple shots, and then you came back and pushed him against the ropes and stopped him. That's when I had to wake up. You know I was I got a little comfortable, but that happens though. You have I'm having fun. Were you surprised I'm, that he came back like that after? Losing I wasn't surprised. I, I knew we knew he was durable. We knew he was gonna come in ready. But that's why we came in extra ready for, for whatever he brought to the table. That part of the learning process, it's the first time uh, guys have hit back on you a few times, is part of the learning process? It's part of the game. Everybody get hit, Floyd get hit, Muhammad Ali got hit, Joe Frazier got hit, B-Hop get hit. Everybody get hit in the game. But the point is boxing, it's hit and not get hit. As you, as you can see, the first through the third round, I was hitting him, but he wasn't really landing them clean shots. I was having fun in there. I was jabbing him, sidestepping, whole list. Let me move. Boom. You mentioned that, that he fought Colazzo in the ring, your post fight interview. Um, is that a good measuring stick for you? I mean, did he compare that kind of stuff that, you know, you got him out there for and he went the distance with Colazzo? He had 28 fights. The only fighter that he fought that was a good opponent, a good, a good prospect, a, a top champion was Colazzo. Everybody else on his record, there was nobody's. As you can see, all the guys he fought, they was from Philadelphia. Name one of the guys from his record that he done fought that were at a level, at a championship level, you see none. Because all the guys he fought, were, they was local fighters. We're not saying they cab drivers, but them guys fought 2005, 2006, and that's, that was probably their last fight. He was a fighter that was getting built up at a probably at an arena in, in Philadelphia. They was building him up, letting him get his record up, facing you no know, good dudes or regular opposition for him to for them to sell tickets, I can say. Do you feel like you would have stopped him if, if Smoke were having to stop the fight at that point? Or you the, like you were... the shots was coming in cleaner and cleaner. The, the more I had space in between to land clean shots, that's the harder I landed my shots. So if if I was over here and he's over there, I had enough space to put, you know, a lot of force into my punch. He was just coming. We fought him smart. I thought he was coming in here to box. I thought I was going to have to be the aggressor. He made my job easy tonight by wanting to be a macho man and fight my fight. How, how would you assess your, your performance? Like, you had a grade, you know, put a grade on your performance, or did you grade yourself? Fox Sports 1, first time on, first time on, a, on a major undercard, Best Buy Theater. I said 10 for 10, because a, a lot of people, I know for a fact a lot of people doubted me. I know for a fact, they saw his record, they saw who he fought last, they like, he gonna give Eddie a problem. That wasn't the case. We prepared well, we done sparred with everybody. We needed six, seven weeks for this. And as you can see, if I would've had more time, I, I would've did it in the first round, but I took my time. Golden Boy, they have a lot of action coming up in the next couple months. What show do you expect to be on? They, want, they was talking about September 30th for a youth title, WBC youth title. But we not, we not worried about that right now. I'm turning 21 on Sunday, August 25th. From, from, the, from the time that the fight was stopped till now, we on vacation right now. We enjoying it, soaking up the moment. We the only fighter that stopped them, not TKO. Why, we, why can't I enjoy that in my young career? Stay out of bars. No bars. There you go. Good.